drop a like on this video in the next five seconds if you guys want to get 100,000 V-Bucks on your Fortnite account. What's going on friends and welcome back to a brand new Fortnite's Battle Royale video here onto the channel. In today's video we are going to be looking at every single free reward and item that has come out throughout the entire duration of Chapter 2 Season 2 so that way you guys make sure you redeem everything that you can before the release of Season 3 since it is rapidly creeping up on us. At the time I'm making this video we are only a week away from the release of Season 3. You guys definitely do not want to miss this video with all these free rewards so stick around to the very end. Now, before we dive into the video, we gotta quickly send our daily gift to a lucky subscriber. Now, we actually have a pretty decent item shop, the Neuer skin's back, we got Doggo, Bunny Wolf. I think I'm gonna go ahead and actually send the Bunny Wolf skin, just because this skin looks really, really cool, and it also has a ton of different styles. So you honestly can't go wrong with sending a skin that is pretty customizable. Today's gift is going to Killer Clown Carl, so shout out to you for supporting the channel, and if you guys wanna be like Killer Clown and receive a gift in a future video, all you have to do is drop a like, make sure you're subscribed to the channel with notifications turned on, and also leave your epic usernames down in the comment section below so I can add you and send you the gift. And if you guys are going to be buying anything in the Fortnite item shop, make sure to use my supporter creator code NERPA. The support has been literally insane recently. You guys have been smashing the code. And once we hit 20,000 people using code NERPA, I am going to be doing a big 20 battle pass giveaway for season three, since that's literally coming up here in the next five days. At the time I'm making this video, you guys are almost at 19,000. So, I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys are going to shatter the 20,000 goal either tomorrow or the next day so make sure to use my code if you have not already we got a big battle pass giveaway coming up soon now that we got all that out of the way let's hop right into the video i do not want to waste any more time there is so many free rewards that we were able to get in season three this video is probably going to be on the longer side so fast your seatbelts grab a snack and focus up because you guys do not want to miss this so to start the video off obviously there is some pretty obvious free rewards and items that we were able to get throughout the duration of chapter two season two i'm going to quickly go over these because these are pretty much common knowledge that a lot of you guys watching this video probably already know about so I do not want to waste too much time with them the first nine rewards of this video are obviously going to be the Deadpool rewards now you do need to own the chapter 2 season 2 battle pass in order to unlock the Deadpool challenges which of course every single week we had a challenge set come out which once you completed them actually gave you a different Deadpool themed cosmetic in total there is nine weeks and throughout these nine weeks there is a bunch of different rewards we have the Deadpool skin the X4 style for the Deadpool skin, a maskless version, we had a glider, a weapon wrap, a few different emoticons, loading screens, badges, and all types of rewards that you guys probably already have unlocked at this point. Now another main source of free items and rewards this season, and this is actually one of the biggest chunks, and I didn't even realize how many free rewards were actually a part of this. If you go over to the season 2 battle pass and you scroll through, you would see that about every 4-5 to five tiers in the battle pass, there is a reward that actually says free underneath. All of these that say free are actually rewards that you can get without owning the chapter 2 season 2 battle pass. I feel like a lot of people don't even know about this but all you have to do is reach the level of what tier the free reward is actually at on your chapter 2 season 2 rank. Once you hit that you guys will unlock it. I'll throw the image up on the screen. There is a total of 17 free rewards and this pretty much encompasses a bunch of different types of items and cosmetics. We have emotes, there's a glider, a weapon wrap, a few different loading screens and there's also a total of 400 free V-Bucks that you guys are able to get from the Chapter 2 Season 2 Battle Pass as well. This free Battle Pass reward system that I think is new in the game because I don't recall ever having these free rewards that everyone's able to get a part of the Battle Pass in previous seasons of Fortnite. So in basic summary, if you guys are level 100 or higher for Season 2 so far, you will have all 17 of these rewards unlocked. So you pretty much don't have to worry about it, but I wanted to include it in the video because I feel like most people overlook this and it was actually actually surprising that there's 17 tiers out of the 100 that are actually free for everyone without owning the battle pass. Now the next set of rewards is still available in the game right now that you guys all watching are able to get. Obviously we are six days away from the release of season three which gives you plenty of time to complete this and that is the storm the agency challenges that were added into the game after the 12.61 downtime updates which I think came out about three weeks ago. If you guys did not know this there was a brand new challenge set called storm the 
agency. In total, there is five different challenges a part of this set. Two of the individual challenges will actually give you a pickaxe and a weapon wrap. And upon completing all five of these Storm the Agency challenges, the main reward that you will be granted is a glider. Of course, as I'm talking about all these rewards, I will throw the images up on the screen just in case you guys didn't know they came into the game or in case you have not seen what they actually look like. But this is a really, really easy way to get three different free rewards. And like I said, you guys have six days till season three. It is plenty of time. The challenges themselves are super easy. There's also additional XP that you can earn in these as well. So if you are trying to get that gold Peely before season three, this is a great way to get some bonus XP. Now, the next reward that we are looking at is a smaller caliber reward. It is actually an emoticon, but this one is actually pretty secretive. Some of you guys might have already unlocked this. I know when this first initially was found in the Fortnite community, a lot of creators out there in the community actually made videos on how to do this. But if you guys did not know, there is actually a secret little Easter egg located over in the Ghost and Shadow rooms for all of the Battle Pass skins, in which if you do a certain combination of clicking on little things hidden in the background, you guys will actually get the Peely Badge emoticon, which is kind of like a secret hidden reward. I actually showed you guys how to do this in a previous video, but in case you guys do not know how to do it, I'll throw gameplay up in the background. It's actually super easy, and if you have not unlocked this emoticon yet, it'll literally take you 20 seconds of you hopping on Fortnite and doing this little Easter egg in order to get this reward. So I wanted to touch on that because I thought it was really cool that this was actually like a secret reward they added into the game that at first a lot of us didn't even know existed. And the next two rewards that we are going to briefly be touching on, mainly because I've actually talked about these in a lot of previous videos that we've made here on the channel is actually for the brand new PlayStation Celebration Pack that was released at the very beginning of Chapter 2 Season 2. Like I said, at this point, I feel like most of you guys know what the Celebration Packs are. In case you don't, I'm going to do a brief overview and summary. So it's pretty much Epic Games and Fortnite's way of doing a little collaboration with PlayStation and pretty much every single brand new season of Fortnite, they release a Celebration Pack, which usually has a variety of different rewards. Some of the previous celebration packs we've actually seen only came with contrails and gliders. Some have had harvesting tools. Luckily for you guys, for everyone that plays on PlayStation, the one that we had earlier this season that is still available for everyone to get actually contains a free skin and a free backling, which I think is super cool because obviously getting free skins is like the best free reward that you can get in Fortnite. Now, how you actually get the celebration packs is by, of course, owning a PlayStation and playing Fortnite on the PlayStation, but you must have PlayStation Plus active on your account in order to redeem this. If you guys do have PlayStation Plus on your account, all you have to do is go over to the PSN store, search up celebration pack. From there, you're going to hit download. And the next time you hop on Fortnite, you guys will see the free rewards of whatever celebration pack just recently came out popping up on your screen. Another mini collaboration that I feel like most of of us actually forgot and honestly when I was doing the research for this video I totally forgot about this as well but Fortnite actually did a little collaboration with a brand new app called House Party. Now this collaboration took place pretty early on in season two which is why a lot of us probably forgot about it but pretty much Fortnite and House Party did a little collab where if the community actually downloaded House Party and answered I think 100,000 correct answers because the app itself is like a trivia or quiz app then we were all granted a a free weapon wrap. Now, of course, we actually met the quota. And if you guys remember, once you logged on to Fortnite, you should have been greeted with this loading screen here. So everyone was able to get this. If you guys have not been on Fortnite for the last like month or so, definitely log on because there has been a ton of different free rewards and items that we've been able to get from little collaborations like this, where honestly, I didn't download the app. I didn't actually contribute to it, but we still got the reward for free. So I wanted to include it in the video because I know a lot of people probably forgot about it at this point. Now, in terms of collaborations, Fortnite definitely did not drop the ball this season. They actually did multiple massive collaborations with big companies. And the biggest name this season that we saw was actually Travis Scott, of course, Everyone knows about the concert. I know so many people were on. They probably watched it live. A lot of you guys probably listened to Travis Scott and like his music before Fortnite even did a collaboration with him. But this massive collaboration and event that Fortnite did with Travis Scott and the live concerts also brought us a total of six free rewards that we were able to earn, which is amazing. The first set of three rewards that you were able to get was literally just for attending the live event. Now, the awesome thing about this is Fortnite actually made a mistake and they pretty much just sent these free rewards 
cards out to every single person that played Fortnite that day. So even if you guys were out traveling or if you were not able to actually watch the live concert, you were still able to get these free rewards, which considering it was like a glider and some really awesome loading screens, it was definitely the easiest free rewards we were ever going to get in Fortnite. And they actually turned out to be really, really cool. Now on top of this, they also did a Travis Scott exclusive challenge set that was in the game for about a week during the live event concert showings. If you completed all of these challenges, you were also able to get a free emote and a total of three other free rewards as well. And unfortunately, they're not in the game anymore. But like I said, most of you guys probably were playing Fortnite at this time. The game was really hype. Everyone was super, super excited for this live event. And a lot of you guys probably redeemed these as well. But I did want to touch on this because this was the largest scale collaboration. And so far this season, that was the biggest live event we saw. Now, on top of that, Fortnite also did their annual Twitch Rivals competition where they partner up with Twitch to actually do a Fortnite style tournament with a lot of the bigger streamers and people a part of the Fortnite content creation community. Now unfortunately you were not able to get these rewards anymore but I did want to touch on these because the Twitch Rivals event did take place earlier this season and this video is encompassing every single free reward and item that we were able to get throughout the duration of season two which this is obviously included. So I'll throw the images up on the screen so you guys could see what they look like for yourselves. In total there was three free rewards you were able to get during the Twitch Rivals tournament and all you had to do in order to get these was link your Twitch account to your Epic Games account and then from there all you had to do was watch all of the Twitch partnered streamers that were taking place in this tournament and the more that you watched the better chances you actually had at getting a drop which gave you all these rewards. So unfortunately it was kind of RNG and luck based. Some people could have watched for five hours and not gotten the rewards and some of you guys probably could watch for like 30 minutes, get lucky and actually got dropped the rewards. So these are probably going to end up being pretty rare mainly because a lot of people didn't know about this and there was a lot of luck involved as well and very similar to the twitch rivals loot we also had some fncs loot as well which gave us another three free rewards these rewards were actually super cool i love the branding and the theme of the black and gold with the fncs which if you guys do not know is the competitive fortnite league or professional league where all of the best fortnite players in the world compete for a lot of money and prize pool. now this event was actually really really similar Similar to Twitch Rivals, they were actually streaming the FNCS tournament over on Twitch as well. And all you had to do, really similar to Rivals, is link your Twitch and Epic Games account, watch all of the streams that were partnered with the FNCS, and just like Rivals, it was pretty much a luck base where you would randomly get a drop and you would actually get all three of these free rewards. Now, the FNCS and Twitch Rivals loot is probably going to end up being pretty rare because these are items and rewards that are never going to be coming back into the game, and they were also geared towards the theme of those individual events which means there's not going to be any more loot or rewards or items coming out in Fortnite that are going to be remotely similar to these so if you guys were able to get your hands on these earlier in the season congrats to you you probably got yourself some rare stuff if you guys did not well that's unfortunate I was not able to get the twitch rivals or FNCS loot so uh, I guess we just missed out now the last two free rewards that we are going to be looking at in today's video are actually going to be loading screens now the first one already came out in the game and unfortunately you were not able to get any more but a few weeks ago in Fortnite Battle Royale, they actually released a loading screen into the item shop that was pretty much the chapter 2 season 2 official loading screen. The only way you were able to get this is if someone on your friends list sent it to you as a gift. Obviously, it was in the item shop as zero V-Bucks and I'm pretty sure they did it this way so that way a lot of people got engaged with the item shop and used the gifting feature where you had to send it to your friends. So if you were not able to get this, it's unfortunate. One of you guys that I have added actually sent it to me and I made sure to send it to one of you guys on my friends list so that worked out really, really well but I did want to include it in the video because I thought it was a cool idea and concept of how they actually released it into the game. Now the last loading screen I will throw up on the screen. Now this one is actually not released into the game yet, but it was found in the Fortnite Battle Royale files that after the Doomsday event, which is going to be taking place in exactly four days from the time I am making this video, we will actually be getting this as a free live event reward transitioning into season three. So it's going to be something kind of to look back on and remember season two with the Doomsday event. And you guys could see here, it's pretty Pretty much Midas looking at his Doomsday Midas gear and uh, I feel like there's a lot of hidden Easter eggs in this one as well but I don't really want to touch on that too much because that's a whole other video in itself but it is going to be a free reward that we get after the Doomsday event so I wanted to include it in the video and there you guys have it 47 free items rewards skins 
all types of every single cosmetic we've ever seen in Fortnite that you were able to get throughout the entire duration of Chapter 2 Season 2. Looking back at this season, there was a lot of ups and downs, there was a lot of good updates, and I definitely think this season was 10 times better than Chapter 2 Season 1, but it's insane the fact that we had so many collaborations, little mini events, opportunities to get free rewards, and honestly, I cannot thank Epic Games enough for giving us an opportunity to get so much free stuff. It almost feels like every single time a new season comes out, they just release more and more free items, which of course, for all of you guys that don't have money, you might be younger and your parents don't want to buy you stuff, it's a great deal for you. So that is all I got for you guys in today's video. Before we end it off, let me know down in the comment section of all 47 free rewards that we looked at and saw throughout the duration of season two, which one is your favorite? And also, if I did miss any free items or rewards, let me know down in the comment section below. I tried doing as much research as I possibly could for this video. I feel like I got everything, but there's so much that happened this season that I feel like I could have easily skipped over something. So if I did miss something, let me know down below as well. I appreciate the feedback and I love seeing your guys' comments down. That's all I got for you guys today. If you enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you're brand new, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take it easy, my friends.